action. Big Boss Clan face, the party ends here and now. You shouldn't have come, Aaron. What? You know my name? Wow. I mean, is it too much to ask for an autograph or selfie? No, you're right. I should wait till after I beat you and foil your evil plan. Getting ahead of myself, sorry. Amusing. I know you better than you think, former Agent Saver, but it appears not as much as I thought. Wait for it. Here comes the evil villain monologue. Silence! I thought it was enough to leave you out cold, broken and bedridden in a hospital, to keep you away from the wild bots and what was to come. Um, are you stalking me? Cause that's creepy. Who the hell are you? <laughs> Wait, the raid? That doesn't make any sense. You? You leaked my operation and organized that ambush? Technically, we could say it wasn't me, but Roy. But Roy? What the hell? He was my partner. You're crazy. He didn't betray me. He was killed by the wild bots. Oh yes, how tragic. But did you see him die? I... I blacked out when I lost my arm. <sighs> Roy. Weeks before the ambush, he kept saying we should leave the case. Perhaps he was trying to save you from the rabbit hole. But alas, like Alice, you've fallen into Wonderland. You're trying to mess with my head. What connection does Roy have to an android revolt? That, my dear Aaron, is a question that no longer serves any purpose. For in but a few moments when the sun rises, this building will become history, and the rebellion will begin. Aw, oh, that's cute. You still think your plan is gonna work. What? You don't expect me to just stand here and watch as you blow this whole place up, do you? I know you, Aaron. I expected nothing less from you. Time to Action. fly! <laughs> Spread gun. Flame gun. Rocket launcher. Oh, did you get a machine gun? Flame gun. Hand gun. Machine gun. Flame gun. Ah. 
up we go. <laughs> Let's play another 
was intense. Turns out the Big Bad Cojones was a cyborg. This new level of technology, a machine that is indistinguishable from human form, has some seriously messed up implications. 
Oh, it also had a radioactive bomb contained inside of it, ready to be activated at dawn. Naturally, I didn't let that happen. Scientists later determined that the bomb would have detonated if at the scheduled hour, it had retained a glimmer of energy. The Android Rebellion never happened. With no signal marking its beginning and having destroyed their main leaders, the whole thing was DOA. Dead on arrival. Sure, in the aftermath there were some serious altercations in Bot City, but it didn't take long for my degenerate city to return to what it called normality. What I still don't understand is that the cyborg hinted that Roy might still be alive. It accused him of betraying everything I thought he stood for. It spoke as if it knew me. I know it's impossible. There was an official funeral for Roy. One I couldn't attend because I was in hospital, but it happened. The whole department was there. It can't... Roy... I won't rest until I know for sure. of cyborgs be ready within a month and a half. I think you'll find these creations to be rather special. For your sake, Doctor, you'd better make sure of it. The prototypes used at Tamanaka Plaza were disappointing. I assure you, the new models will suit your requirements. I expect nothing less. Sir, what about the girl? She... Have plans to ensure she will not interfere again. That is none of your concern. It is a personal matter. 